Yeah. Are you sure they're ready for Dude, this? Dude, I don't think so. All right, bro. The, the, what does it say? Fantastic SpongeBob glasses, bro. Jeez. Let's go. Oh, okay. Yeah. And you know, I got the hat to match. <laughs> Cause I just, I love motorcycles so much. I'll do anything to be on a bike. And I got cool friends that let me borrow their bikes too. I ended up just meeting a bunch of guys that liked wheelies as much as I did. And we kind of just were like, why don't we make a group? Not really like a gang or anything. It was just like a bunch of guys that would ride together. Every day, honestly, we were out like late at night if, if we had to work early, we were still out just riding in these parking lots. Just having fun, like just hanging out with the boys and, and obviously like they bring their girlfriends too and kids and dogs. And uh, we kind of got two spots where we ride. We've been riding for two years now. Um, so starting the Ford Lot Boys was like kind of our end to, I guess, building a scene out here in Mesa. Because there really isn't a, a stunt scene out here. We have guys that like wheelies and we made a group to just get really good in parking lots, like right here in one space, you know? Everyone wants to do it, because it is. It's like, it's the show off sport, right? You know, everyone wants to be that cool guy doing that sick trick, but there's like a right way and a wrong way to doing it. So there's guys that will go out and do it on the streets and they'll hurt themselves because they see us do it. And we seem like the bad guys when we're like, don't be doing that because we're just trying to look out for them and say, you know, we don't want you to hurt yourself. If you want to learn, you come ride with us in our spots where we're doing controlled training and we're just all helping each other learn how to ride. I don't really consider myself a stunt rider because I like bikes, just not stunning in particular because I just got really good because that's what I ended up enjoying the most was the adrenaline and I mean, getting together with your friends and, and, I mean, as slow as we ride, bro, when we crash, like, it's funny. We'll laugh at each other because you're just like, that fun that crash was funny. Uh, and then we really just grew as, like, friends and family to, I don't know, just go out and have fun on these bikes. And that's what kind of brought us all together. Everyone kind of has their, their out of what helps them escape whatever they got going on. People like to go fishing or people like to hunt. It's the same thing with motorcycles. There's just, it's very unique in how obsessed like my guys are. Like they love their motorcycles like no other object I've ever seen someone love something, you know? It really is special. 100%. We could die any set. All these guys that ride motorcycles know. And they all say a prayer before they get on their bikes and take their ride because it is. All it takes is one car, man. Everyone's kind of gotten together and made this a thing of we just get together and have fun. You know, doesn't matter where we are, we just found a good spot like Cycle Gear puts on bike nights and we kind of just talked with them. I was bugging them forever like, you know, when are we going to do some cool stuff together and it just kind of happened, you know. <laughs> <laughs>